दिस इज थर्टी इयर्स मेल पेशेंट वन एपिसोड ऑफ टेन डेज फीवर बिफोर वन मंथ पेशेंट अकॉर्डिंग टू पेशेंट अकॉर्डिंग टू द हिस्ट्री गिवन बाय द पेशेंट ही हैज टेकन द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ टाइफॉइड एट प्रेजेंट द विडल टेस्ट शोज वन इज टू सिक्सटी टाइटल and this is the ileum terminal ileum and the lumen of this terminal ileum is hyperechoic this is a sign of more likely pseudo membrane formation it could be ulcerative colitis also uh, sorry uh, inflammatory bowel disease any type of either crohn's or ulcerative colitis you see this cecum this is the cecum which is significantly inflamed edematous thickened cecum with hyperechoic inner lumen this is more likely pseudo membrane formation in in this whole of this mucosal layer you see this hyperechoic area it is in usg this this term is called nematosis intestinalis air inside the intestine air also looks like this and uh, pseudo membrane formation also looks like this but it could be a mixture of both we can say this is the descending colon this descending colon also shows inside hyperechoic mucosa now we will scan for the transverse colon transverse colon is not so much affected in fact uh, i cannot see the transverse colon which is pathological but this this cecum is too much uh, edematous this is the terminal ileum this is the terminal ileum and it is merging here with this cecum there is a, li a lymph node also enlarged lymph node surrounding this ileum this is ileum this is cecum cecum is uh, is showing little bit increased vascularity ileum not so much appreciated in terms of vascularity this is ileum this according to me is looking more like uh, crohn's disease because there are multiple this enlarged lymph nodes ileum cecum these are the lymph nodes ileocecal lymph nodes 
and uh, as you as i am going upward i don't see ascending colon which is affected just uh, this 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 is the cecum which is severely edematous and thickened but if i go further upward i don't see this uh, ascending colon here uh, this descending colon is descending colon is uh, thickened and edematous and inside if we see this very hyperechoic lumen this is a sign of pseudo membrane formation here there is no gas because gas will give dirty shadow but here inside there is no i think gas it is more like uh, pseudo membrane yes here you see no dirty shadow more likely pseudo membrane formation it is a case of crohn's disease although there is a increased there is increased titer of vidal but we have to rely more on the findings and the esg findings clinical findings sometimes you uh, the laboratory reports may not be reliable this is the ileum because at present patient is not having fever